This week we're having our inaugural New Zealand Tech Roadshow here in Korea. Our main responsibility is providing an environment in which New Zealand and Korean organisations can interact, network, take advantage of any of our opportunities that may exist between the two parties. On top of that, our key responsibilities are about not only commercial, but cultural, providing high value events for our, our members to engage in, both from the Korean side and from the New Zealand side. This is an opportunity for us to bring technology firms to Korea to showcase what New Zealand is happening to do, to kind of change the image of New Zealand slightly. We are often being confused with sheep, mountains, beautiful scenery. We are not just about haka and the clean green image, tourism and Lord of the Rings. We are great people to do business with. New Zealand is a tech savvy country. We hold great values such as collaboration, transparency and integrity. The New Zealand Embassy works very closely in Korea with the New Zealand Chamber of Commerce. Uh, the Chamber has been running for many years a very successful program of events called Inspire with Innovation Leadership. And what we're trying to do with this particular series is to profile the innovation that we do, which I think is actually really inspirational. This uh, tech roadshow that we're running this week kind of falls within this Inspire with Innovation area. Four firms participated in the New Zealand Tech Roadshow and they were Aware Group, a global leader at counting and classifying through the use of artificial intelligence, Centrality, a global software and venture investment company that specializes in AI and blockchain technology, Revolution Fibers that produces high-tech nanofiber textile, and Code Avengers, a tech education company that prepares students for the opportunity of tomorrow. The tech sector alone accounts for $11 billion of revenue and $7.9 billion of that is exported. And that makes the tech sector New Zealand's third largest export industry. Now New Zealand's not a huge player, but we are traditionally a trailblazer in technology and innovation. We have world leading technology in areas like launching satellites from commercial rockets, smart farming, digital filmmaking and healthcare technology. There's really no limit to what Korea and New Zealand can accomplish together in this sector. We have the opportunity to create really 21st century collaboration between our companies. We can of course run events telling you how to do business in Korea. There's plenty of organisations that can tell you to do that and of course we can help you in the Kiwi Chamber by telling you what we can do. But the great thing is to tell people about the New Zealand story, our inspiration, our innovation, things that make us great.